What's up guys and welcome back to some more Five Nights at Freddy's Security Reach Ruin. As you guys know in the last video, we started hacking the game and we found a beta version of, I think it's called MXES, that little like rabbit thing that hunts you around the entire game. And we also did some pretty fun hacking, just kind of going around different areas and seeing what we could find. But we're going back in today because, well, we're going to be doing something a little bit fun. As I'm sure you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail, this is going to be an interesting video. We have Circus Baby and Glamrock Bonnie in the game and they're going to be hunting us down. Now to start though, we got to go ahead and go to Profile 1, Chapter 9 and hop into chapter nine. So now we could continue from the menu right there into chapter nine, but if we do that, it'll start it at the, like, the incorrect point, basically right when we get chased, but there's a, a point before that that I really wanna show you guys, a cutscene that I think is gonna be way cooler than just starting it from there. So we do have our hacks on though, like normal. Okay, I thought I did, never mind, I don't. <laughs> Let me turn it on real quick. Aha, there we go. You see that on the top left, camera found. All right, so now we can go ahead and toggle debug camera. Let's go ahead and start flying around. And honestly, no, 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 you know what? Let's leave the lighting how it is for now. For this first thing that we're gonna see though, you know, it's not the craziest thing. Wait, where are we? Oh, okay, dude, it's so dark all of a sudden. I did reset my game settings, so that could be why. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and teleport Cassie right there and uh, spawn in as, her oh wait, I forgot, dude. We almost forgot about Roxy. Oh, my, I'm so sorry, Roxy. <laughs> Imagine we just left her there for eternity, dude. Just sitting there, just waiting for someone to save her. I would have felt pretty bad. All right, so there we go. Yes. What are you doing? What am I doing? You know what? Let me show you what I'm doing. Oh, no, I can't toggle deep. I, can't. <laughs> I was going to just teleport away. Goodbye, Roxy. R.I.P. She's dead. I'm so sorry. I I'm so sorry. Happy birthday, Cassie. Blah, 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 Roxy. Just die already. No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before we... Dude, wait. Before we continue, uh, my brother Rexter showed me this. Hold on. I, I got to show you guys this, too. So, this is pretty cool. Like, I did not notice this when we first get, went to this part. So, if we go back here, though, to where we spawned, right? Look at this. This is cool. So, right here in the room that we spawn in, uh, let me go ahead and do next view mode a few times here. Uh, let's go ahead and get it a little bit brighter in here. Just a little bit brighter in here. There we go. All right, so right in the room that we spawn in, check this out. So you see these little plushies right here? Look at them. Okay, now, originally, they just look like, you know, normal plushies of the animatronic. You see these kind of everywhere throughout the game. And, well, if you look closely, Glamrock Chica is missing her beak. Glamrock Freddy is missing his head, and his stomach is ripped open. And Montgomery Gator, well, I mean, yeah, RIP to him. He's been split in half, and, you know, this is the part of him that we see nowadays, and this is the part of him that... We don't see, and he won't be seeing for a long time. Uh, and then Roxanne, missing her eyes, really beat up. Like, that is such a cool little Easter egg that I never noticed. But look at that. that that's so awesome. All right, so anyways, I want to show you guys that real quick. Now, uh, let's go ahead and head into the end of the game here. And uh, we got some other stuff to do here, which is pretty insane. So we want to start by just going and flying through all of this. None of this matters. We want to go and get on the elevator, though, and head on down. All right, here we are down in the uh, the basement. What do you want to go? All right, Cassie. We, you did this last video, okay? You keep crying. You keep on crying and ruining the video, all right? Just just do it one more time and see what happens. All right, so we're going to go ahead and go down this way, though. Uh, we want to fly past all of this. Obviously, you know, you got a, a bunch of cool stuff in here, but we don't care about any of it right now because we've got things to do, people to see. Uh, Candy Cadet, though, very interesting story that that thing t tells. Let me know your, your uh, theories in the comment section down below because, like I said, I was talking to my brother Rexter, and he was telling me some interesting things about that thing, um, you know, about the storyline and how it could be the mother was, like, the mimic, and they trapped it down here. I don't know. Like, it, there's there's a bunch of stuff. Okay, wait, where am I? I am completely lost. There we go. Okay, hello? Where am <laughs> Dude, where am I? Hold on. Okay, you drop down here. Okay, you know what? Let me just let me just do. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah, check this out. If you guys haven't seen this already, aha! Uh -huh, look who the backpack belongs to. Which I mean, I that's the only person I thought it belonged to. Like when I saw the backpack, I was like, okay, that's definitely Gregory's. You know, from Security Breach, the main game. But uh, just to make it very obvious, they put Gregory's little name tag right there. So. Yeah, that's a super cool little detail right there. All right, so we're going to go ahead and teleport down here. Of course we are. Toggle debug camera, hop into here, and uh, let's go ahead and shut off MXES, which is a horrible idea, but, you know, why not? Uh, yep, are you sure you want to do this? Of course I do. And here we go. Oh, no, dude. MXES is turned off. Woo! Or I guess the, the, the firewall that was keeping it in there is. And there it goes. It's dead. <laughs> and there we go. Are you in there? Yeah, dude. Yeah, I'm sure. Well, it looks like someone poured concrete over the door. Oh, yeah, really? How am I supposed to get rid of concrete? Hmm. I wonder why. Why would somebody pour concrete over a door? You know, there's a giant metal door that's obviously keeping something in, Cassie. 
And you know, you, you remove that door, right? And then you're like, hmm. They also put concrete over this. I wonder, what's going on here? <laughs> why are they, why, what are they trying to creep in here? No, she doesn't care about any of that. She's like, Gregory, I'm right here. I'm here, okay? Gregory. You know what, Cassie, you know? Gregory, you okay? Yep, all right, now, hold on a minute. Now, if we go in here, is this going to be in here what we're about to witness? I don't see anything. I'm gonna go ahead, let's toggle, uh, let's do some next view modes here. See if we can spot this thing in the dark. Okay, so it is not here. All right, well, here we go. Let's go ahead and turn it off again. There we go, and let's head inside. Let's see what this thing is. This is definitely gonna be a surprise, because I don't think I'm gonna put this one in the thumbnail, so. You saved me. You saved, you saved me. me. Oh, you see it? Gregory? You see it? Uh, oh my god. <laughs> it looks so cool. You're not Gregory. What? What are you? Oh, this is. I, I, Gregory. This is so cool. I, I, Dude, oh my gosh. This mod looks fantastic. So, this is the first mod that we're going to be trying on this video. And uh, it's Circus Baby. Now, obviously, if you're wondering why we're doing Circus Baby here, well. We're going to be getting the scooper ending, and I feel like, you know, it only makes sense for Circus Baby to be the one that does this, so. And them fighting up here. Now, wait, wait, wait. If we pause, they're not up here, right? Toggle debug camera. Nope. They are gone. I mean, I'm assuming they're in the dark right there, but I don't, I don't think we'll be able to actually see them. All right, well, I think I might have broken my game just now. <laughs> oh, no, I did it again. Dude, remember when I did this last time? Oh, no, we're good. We're good. We're back. Oh, my gosh. How do I know this is you for real? Come on, Cassie. You need to get out of there now. How? Oh my friend has access to the building maps. Just follow instructions. Who do you guys think is, uh, his friend is, by the way? Do you think it's Glamrock Freddy? Do you, think it, do you think it's Vanessa? You know, let me know your theories on that one in the comments section. Oh, here she is. Oh, my. Dude, it looks so cool, man. I love mods for this game because it can. Oh, my God. Dude, it can do so much. It can add so much to the game. Hold on, should we get jump scared by her first? Oh my gosh, dude, look at her. Look at her, her arms are kind of weird looking, but dude, this mod is sick. Right, let's get attacked. So that's what the jump scare looks like. Unfortunately, the face plates do not open, but I mean, it makes sense. It's only like a skin for the character. But hey, I mean, to be able to see Circus Baby in Ruin is very cool. All right, here we go again. This time, let's actually try running. You know, let's not just stand there and let her kill us, so. I feel like that's probably you know a little bit better thing to do than just standing there and dying, but uh, you know you gotta you gotta risk it every once in a while. All right, here we go. We're back in. Let's go. All right, so this time we're gonna go straight to the ending. We're gonna get the scooping ending because you know, like I said, it only makes sense with baby. Like who else? Who else can we have here besides baby? You know, it's gotta be her. She's behind us though. We gotta go. I'm pretty excited though to see. Speaking of baby, what do you guys think about Help Wanted uh, Two? How, how, are you guys excited for that one? Because I'm very much excited for that. Especially, you know, after loving the first Help Wanted 1 was my favorite FNAF game of all time until Security Breach. So, Help Wanted 2? Ooh, I'm very much excited. And we're gonna, it's going to take place in Sister Location? Like, ooh, it just gets better and better. All right, here we go. She is somewhere back there. Hello? Come on, keep up. Where are you going? Hello? Huh? Where? There you are. Okay, time to run. Look at you guys notice this, by the way. Look, if you run, look, keep an eye behind you, right? Watch what happens. Watch what happens. So, you get right here. And then, if I get right here, it just turns away. <laughs> the door closes and she just runs away. Like, what is happening? All right, let's go ahead and toggle debug camera. Oh, wait, no, I have to pause it. Whoops. Um, I think I might have just broken it. Uh, oh, my. Look at her arms. What am I doing? Oh, no, we're good. Uh, it's still playing the cut. No, it's playing the cutscene. Um, okay, unpause. Unpause. <laughs> we're breaking it. <laughs> the audio's not going to be in sync. Oh, my dude. How cool is that, man? That is so cool, man. Holy. So she's gonna show up again, right? Oh no, that's, oh yeah, no, she already got scooped. Oh, oh, what? <laughs> she, she transformed, how'd she do that? What the? All right, well, <laughs> that's the death of baby. That's how it happened right there, dude. She got scooped and uh went into some fog and then turned into the mimic in another outfit because why not all right let's head into the next mod though so this one's gonna be very cool this is the one that i'm most looking forward to which i'm sure you guys could probably see by the title and thumbnail of this video this one's gonna be fun okay so for this one we gotta go to chapter select we gotta go to chapter i want to say eight yep Phaser blast and um this one 
replaces Glamrock Freddy, and uh, it's someone that, well, you guys know who it is. It's Glamrock Bonnie. Now, we know we find Glamrock body, Bonnie, bo not body. Uh, well, actually, we do find his body, though. Uh, we find him in the, you know, uh, Bonnie Bowl area, like hidden behind, you know, the, the actual, like, bowling area, and he's just kind of there dead on the ground, and you can kind of, like, you know, go around finding all these little, little, like, cleaning robots and releasing these souls from them or whatever you're doing, and uh, it eventually lets you find him, and then you can, like, find the last four cleaning bots in there and it like takes the soul out of them it's very strange now he's dead though so what we did in this mod is we brought him back to life okay and this is going to be very cool all right so the two signs have been deactivated i have dude i've learned these things by heart after playing this level so many tra times trying to look for that last uh cleaning robot it's it's awful like how many times i had to play this level anyways though now that those are done we're gonna go ahead and use this and we have to do this pretty quick because oh no dude i hate when it gives me a difficult one okay so we gotta go up here oh dude how, how good am i at this oh dude we're, we're we're puzzle solvers here we are puzzle solve no get off my screen okay here we go done carry breach node breached and now we can teleport into the area that we're looking for so we gotta go ahead and deactivate this take off the mask and here we go all right well let's try that again i uh, i forgot to put the mod on <laughs> so here we go wait he's invisible <laughs> where is he no what did i do oh there he is what? i killed him again and then i brought him back to life oh my uh why is his head in there oh dude this spot is it looks so good what the heck okay he kind of like killed me without looking me in the eyes which is kind of rude but it looks good. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta, like, pause this whenever we get, like, a good look at him. This one looks awesome, man. I love these mods because, like, it's such a small little thing that you can change that, like, just changes the entire game in a way. Especially, you know, theory-wise and stuff like that. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna wait for him to get up. I'm gonna get this ready. We're gonna pause it right when he's standing up in front of us, and we're gonna get a good look at this thing, but it looks awesome. Oh, man, I can't wait until we finally, you know... Glamrock Bonnie finally gets the love that he deserves, dude. Because, like, right now, he doesn't, all right? He's dead on the ground, his legs ripped off, stuff like that. Like, come on. Show this man some love. All right, so let's go ahead and do, uh, let's do some toggle uh, of next view mode here. There we go. So this is what the mod looks like. Obviously with horrible lighting, but it is. Oh, my gosh. It's so cool. I love this so much. Awesome. I love how the eye is, like, hanging down like that. It's so good. All right, so let's go ahead and get it back to normal. Oh my, wait, now I think I made it too dark now. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm ruining the game. Okay, hold on, one more time. No, one more, one more time. There we go. All right, let's do this. Um, okay, there. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, now pause. Run, run. Oh my, wait, where do I go? Oh my gosh, I'm lost. Ah, so run, 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 run. No, I'm stuck. Go, go, go. Come on, come on. We can do this. It's fine. Okay. He's he's uh he's kind of silent though. When I'm out of stamina. Oh, he's right there. It's fine. We have plenty of time. Don't worry. Look at this. I got. I'm fine. I'm not gonna die here. Look, I know what exactly what I'm doing here. I'm not gonna get stuck on this, like I did in my main playthrough. We're gonna just keep on running. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh my. No, he's he's all the way back there. We're good. We made it, right? I don't think he jumps down here, does he? Uh, look at him. He can't jump down here. I don't think he does. Nope. I don't know where he goes. Oh, he's just he's just running around. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Where is he? What's he doing back here? Where is he? Dude, where? I don't know where he is. It's so dark. I can hear him. Wait, I don't... Wait, wait, wait. Is that him? He's right... He's right here. What are you doing, buddy? Well, what's going on here, huh? Oh, my... Dude, his eyes. I guess, uh, you know, whenever you get to a certain point, he's just like, all right, I'm not chasing you down. <laughs> I already lost my legs one time. All right, I'm not jumping off of that and potentially losing them again. No, thank you. All right, here we go. The finale. Oh, with the blue lighting. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, my gosh. Look at this thing. So, obviously, we deactivate it. Oh, my. Now, in this sequence right here, he moves extremely slow. Um, you know, because obviously, once you be able to put on your mask. And check this out. I didn't know this in our playthrough. I thought he just, like, disappeared. But, look, if you take off the mask... He's still there. He's just always there, just kind of like slowly following you. And man, this mod, dude, I love it. So it looks fantastic. All right, so obviously we go in here and we are out of here. By the way, if you're missing a gift box in this room, look right here. This one took me so long to find, but it's right there. There's another one up ahead. All right, I'm going to show you guys. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Dude, get in the vent. Oh, my God. I'm stuck again. What's happening? 
Oh, oh yeah, by the way, these guys can kill you if you uh, aren't quick enough. I learned that the hard way because I jumped out of the vent and I kind of like stood next to it and then he killed me. I don't know how, but he did. Uh, I'm going to show you guys this next gift box though because I, I know there's a lot of people that are like, I don't know where this one is. Check this out. It's, it's pretty well hidden. Oh man, do we, need, do we need a mod that changes this guy in the vent? Oh, that would be sick. I could ask the, the developer that does these mods about it. So there's another gift box though right here. Daco was looking for this one forever. I was like, yeah, it's right, it's right here. It's super well hidden. Like, if it's not open, you would never see that. Because, look, it's covered. So, uh, anyways, though, guys, that was some FNAF Security Reach Ruin mods. If you guys want to see more, let me know. Because there's a bunch more that I can download. And uh, we can give them a shot and, and, you know, play them if you guys want to see them. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out.